I see our volumes bouncing. Yeah, it's always a good sign, isn't it? <laughs> oh man, Rolo gets a starring role at the, the title screen here. Oh, cool! Hey, check this out. That's pretty cool. Uh, yes, uh, welcome to the stream, everyone. Hi! Uh, uh, we've got our host here, Susan. Hello. Uh, and I'm Scott. Uh, and we're just going to play more XCOM 2 because we were really getting into this campaign oh, last time. Oh no, Lilith! Allergies! Oh, no, oh, I'm glad that you signed up for allergy shots. Fingers oh, crossed no, those sort you out. Um, the last time we oh, saw Lilith... Oh, hey Lady Lilith! Uh, from the back library. Mm. Well, last Friend. time... Well, Friends of the site. Mm -hmm. Last time we saw Lilith, um, it was it was not pleasant. Suffering from all sorts of allergy stuffs. Uh, I, I hope, hope you feel better. Mm. Uh, like I hope the shots sort you out. Meanwhile, let's give some aliens some shots. Yay! Oh, I see. Oh. That's an amazing transition. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so, just to update the viewers, you've had a, we've sort of had a little bit of practice since last time. Sort mm. of. Mm -hmm. You went um, back to. Yeah, I went back to Enemy Unknown. Actually, um, which is the uh... oh no, that's just Enemy Unknown. Sorry, you didn't. You weren't playing the DLC for Enemy Unknown, were you? No, no, no. I was playing straight um, Enemy classic, Unknown. Classic, yeah. classic, classic, twenty twelve XCOM or whatever it was. Good God, which one was I playing? Eight forty five PM. So is he? Yeah, stream say what? So that's one. That's the one yeah. I was playing. <laughs> oh, we got we're straight into a cutscene. Um, so Lilith wants to play. Might play Yakuza Zero. Or mm. kind of wants to start this area. That's to the, that's a new tales, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's on Steam. Yeah, well. I was I was so happy to hear that Nino Kuni would be coming to PC. Yeah, that's excellent. Because um, I was like, hooray! I don't have to buy a PS4. <laughs> <laughs> that was your point. <laughs> but it's just because it's another it's another console to add to the stack, you know? Yeah, absolutely. Oh God, what was I doing? This looks exactly like XCOM One. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I hear good things about Yakuza Zero. Uh, mm. or Yakuza Zero. Uh, so, I, so do I. I have the fifth one on PlayStation Plus. Uh, for whatever reason, that didn't come to the EU last year. Like the the PlayStation Plus games have sort of converged into the same games now between territories, uh, between Europe and America. But the for whatever reason, there was some licensing issue there, and only America got Yakuza 5 on PS Plus last year. Okay. Um, so, uh, Yakuza 0 was probably a great starting point for anybody, though, it seems like, because it's a prequel, I believe. Okay. Uh, I also got CRT and light guns. I nice. always got CRTs. And you own every Yakuza game, even the Japanese ones. Hmm. Uh, yes, Lilith. Lilith is a bit of a hardcore uh, gamer. <laughs> Beat one to five by Dead Souls. <laughs> Dead Souls is interesting. I don't know if you know what Dead Souls is, Susan. Um, no, I don't uh, know what Dead Souls is. It's a Yakuza side story where uh, a zombie apocalypse is happening during a Yakuza game. Oh, wow. It's, yeah, it's great. It's, it's, it's so funny. Uh, I haven't played through it, but I've seen bits and pieces of it, and I was like, yeah, that's great. What a, what a great idea. It's like I if you were playing like Shenmue or something. And then Is that a Starbucks sudden... there? Just like carefully just... Um... Rah! 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 <laughs> um... Oh no, it's not Starbucks. Starbucks. We just rename her Starbucks. Oh, oh wait, cancel. Yeah, I should... Oh, that's he's him doing his specialist training. Hey, Roly, you're doing like some mad push-ups in the background. Yeah. I'm always doing mad push-ups, bro. <laughs> always doing mad push-ups. <laughs> He says, um, it's like, can I just look at my soldiers for a second? Where's, where's the barracks? That might be a good idea, yeah. Just see where we're at again. I can't bloody see where anything is! <laughs> now, Sue, so if you press Control alt e r t then... No, I'm joking. <laughs> uh, I was, for a second, I was about to do that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, I'm so sorry, everyone. <sighs> right, hang on. When did they die? I can't remember. <laughs> I feel. I thought we. I thought we. I thought we 
but um, yeah, I thought that we would we'd been okay. Unless they are like ones that die in the first mission that you can't stop. I can't remember. Yeah, but I thought we were doing quite well and that we didn't have any... I, I didn't realise we'd lost anybody and uh, that was just a lot of close calls, I thought, but mm. maybe, maybe there are deaths you can't avoid. Maybe. Or maybe it's picked up your saved data from any <laughs> No, shut up! <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, so, Lilith, how is um, Zero stacking up against 1 to 5 so far? Yeah. I'm hearing it's a good starting point. Oh yay! He's he's back in it. Oh, Knuckles is um shaken, so I need to take. Oh, he's gravely wounded. Twenty days. Never mind. Um, oh, no. I should take Squaddy Thomas Williams on a mission and get him sorted out. Mm. Buff them up. Yeah, buff them up. Which one was um? Which one's um Starbucks? Can I not click and view her? Dang yeah. I don't want to like edit her and call her Starbucks. <laughs> I, I, I'm sure there is a way to do that. I can't remember what it is, but um, we did it for Johnny. Okay, so uh, so far it's pretty good. It doesn't seem like there's anything you need to know about the series going in plot wise. Oh, fair enough. So it's a good it's a good sort of like, it, it is a good start point. That's good to hear. Just checking out this area. Look, you're just casually just sitting on like two legs. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're not dug underground like an XCOM one. Um, uh, yeah, the Yakuza games are like... I just describe them as sort of, if you've ever played Shemnu, it's that to the nth degree. Uh, less fetch quests and more random, completely random gambling on pachinko machines. <laughs> Ooh, soldier abilities. Aid protocol. So we've got hack, aid protocol, combat protocol, and haywire protocol. That's right. So cool. that's the ones you've picked in your tech tree. Um, I guess so. Yeah. Okay. So here's his where it's So, it, is she Paula? Yeah, there she is. So, what should we call her? Starbucks. Yeah. Um. Damn it. Character info. Maybe? Yeah. There it is. Um. Starbucks Taylor. That's it. That's it. Great. Let's see. Uh, more information about the CRT. It's a 27 inch Trinitron. Nice. Uh, two Saturn Dreamcast slash. Oh, time crisis. Like, and House yeah. of the Dead. And Virtual Cots. Man, you are sorted. I love, uh, <laughs> I love me some uh, House of the Dead. I'm a big fan of Typing of the Dead. Oh, Typing of the Dead's really fun. I really like Typing of the Suffer Dead. Suffer like G did. <laughs> uh, all the. All the voice acting is on another level, let's say. Uh, but yeah, the, the Trinitrons are starting to dwell or dwindle in number, so good find. Uh, Trinitron, apart f yeah, apart from a couple of specialist PVMs, a Trinitron is about as close as you're going to get to a, a PVM with a CRT, I think. Uh, a PVM being a, like a professional video monitor. Uh, AKA an old... Wait, what? No! Oh, what's happening? Hunt XCOM? No! A UFO hunts the Avenger. If the Dark event president... complete! Commander, remote reconnaissance indicates the aliens have a UFO hunting for our position. Oh, screw you guys! Oh, that, that's not cool. Hmm, does that mean... I did I mean, not... I mean, you can do any preventative measures, but... I guess something's happened still, regardless. Although well, we got training complete for this guy, AIDS protocol. Is that our? Is that the one you're training up to be a medic? Yeah, yeah. And he was just yeah. Oh, look at it go! They seem willing to pass it to. Has been successfully located. They seem willing to provide us with material support in exchange for intel. Good. Good. I need money. Sell inventory. <laughs> <laughs> Give me that sweet, Power sweet sale. money. Flash to the alien alloys, go it cheap. <laughs> Two for a pound. <laughs> Two for a pound. Uh, 50p, well, love, just 50p. <laughs> <laughs> I'll even give you matching socks. Um, Mr. Slilith says, I actually got that on a DC keyboard. Ah, so Lilith has uh, Typing of the Dead as well. Nice. 
Um, I remember a cosplayer who um, I showed up to a convention once dressed as the guy from Type of the Dead with Dreamcast oh, and keyboard. Pack. Yeah, Dreamcast and the keyboard everything. like in front of his in front oh, of his brilliant. face and everything. It was so good. And that he was like so all good. he was like all bloodied up and everything, you know. Like he, <laughs> it was so good. Um, like yeah, Sega, Sega, Sega uh, like from you know mid like 90s through to the early 2000s has this amazing repertoire of things you can cosplay as nice like wacky like you know spa- like when you look at uh, Space Channel 5 and uh, all of their mascots and there's just a lot of weird semi-realistic but also fantastical things that you can are ideal for cosplay are uh, you oh, clearing out another room? Oh, not enough engineers. Oh. How do I recruit engineers, though? Commander? I just need to get them, don't I? For you engineers. <laughs> I see someone modified Nightbot to say Road to 250. <laughs> I thought it was a bit more of a modest goal. <laughs> That's a bit fairer. Oh, Lassaku, no! Oh, yeah, we, we missed you last night. We did miss you, you're one of our MVPs. Uh, last we'll be putting up, the archive is available on Twitch right now, but we'll be putting the archive up on YouTube later. Uh, we had some minor frame rate problems, but it shouldn't be enough to affect enjoyment of stream. We managed to get five people on stream on video, and a sixth person on voice, plus the audience. So it's, it should be a reasonably entertaining stream, I hope you enjoy it. Hey, you did a bloody good job with that. Uh, thank you. I- I probably could have done better if I'd had a separate machine for streaming, but yeah, I've explained the problem there anyway. So. Well, I'm bloody trying to make contact with them. <laughs> I got told off by um, Command for dithering. He's like, make contact, damn it! I'm like, yeah, I'm making contact. Oh, uh, uh, oh, too much is going on! Ooh, Ooh. Arcblade. Ooh. Arcblade. Real talk that. though. Can I afford it right now? <laughs> uh, technically, I should get this installed now because uh, Humble took its payment for the 5th of February or whatever uh, and gave me the key. Ugh. Oh. Ugh. It's the way that, like, when he, like, digs around in it, it kind of goes, yeah. <laughs> Like twitches a little bit, it's so gross. Enjoy your snake lobster. Snake lobster. Or, or snobster. Snobster. <laughs> Looking forward to it, says Lasco. Yes, please. Enjoy Yay. Yeah, it was funny, it got a bit dark towards the end, but. <laughs> and, uh, well, we had Kitty on there, so you know. <laughs> we, I, we had no chance of it being a PG stream as it was. Um, where, where is that alien scumbag that was flying around? There it is. You ain't going after it? Aliens have dedicated an immense amount of time and resources to this project, Commander. Okay, it's okay. Whatever. Let's make contact. Let's just, let's just do it. Let's just do it. Um, I've got to the point in Enemy Unknown where yeah. it's like the first... You know, you know, with the aliens first make their we're stepping up our invasion um, move, yes. and you have like everything's on fire in Brazil, and you need to save loads of civilians, and yeah, it's not going well <laughs> 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 because they keep going over it, and then that's when they introduce like you know the zombifying thing. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, it's just, just like no, why would you do this? Yeah, there is a there is a couple of clear like you have beaten this tier now we're moving on to a new tier of difficulty uh, points in the first game uh, we've got another viewer hello to oh no it's, it's Lasaku no, right. <laughs> <laughs> hello Lasaku <laughs> um, oh was that all I didn't have anything else to do with them was that it it was just make contact does that give you more resources or something yeah, it does. So Re- reduces something. It's so like an install a radio relay. Which do you have cost enough supply? Me, you do uh, have enough supply. Two fourteen. Again, a unique bonus for this content. Will increase the regular I'll... collections to one forty two supplies. Intel cost will be reduced as well for near nearby regions. In the long term, that seems worth it. Building radio relay. How many days? Four. 
four, yes. Okay. Um, so I can make contact with New India, East Asia, and Western I've US. Always been, I've always planning a trip to New India. Arm to the teeth, all primary weapons gain an additional upgrade slot, which is that bonus for that area. What's the bonus for East Asia and New India? Um, in East Asia, I don't know what the bonus is. I guess Won't it's just extra supply. Um, New India is plus 60, plus 77. Yeah. I don't know what their particular bonus is, though. Right, okay. So I've got a mission at the Advent Black site. Heavily guarded, we need to investigate something behalf of the resistance and report back immediately. Um, priority mission. If I... Can I make contact with a place while I... and then go and do a mission and then... I have no idea. I, I guess we'll find out. Once contacted, get a seven... enemy will be available for contact. Okay, so we can't establish any new contacts until we upgrade our systems. Alright, okay. Fair enough. But so you it's can four do days. two at a time. Yeah, I can do two. So that's four days. Alright, okay. That's not oh no, bad. tell a lie. That's not... No, because that's, that's now on pause. Oh shit. You can only choose one then. Ah, oh, bollocks. Oh, let's go do this thing. Okay. Because you might as well go to the, otherwise this entire stream is just going to be me poking around the map. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go um, to Starbucks, Taylor. Yeah, go Starbucks. Oh, right. These are all my... These are all really good people, though. Yeah, maybe you should throw in a rookie. Yeah. Um, Alright, so we've got Corporal Taylor, we've got Corporal Reg Irregular Johnny. They're all too good. So Corporal Jones, this is... Is this the guy who just got upgraded? So he's uh, a sniper. Maybe. Yeah. The thing is that they're all different things. That's true. Which is a bit annoying. Because you like that. I do like yeah. the variety. Yeah. Johnny's uh, quite um. These, the all these guys at the corporal level are quite valuable. That's true. You don't want to lose them all on a single mission. If no. So if I swap out, well, Johnny will be useful, but this guy do. I, it's like, do I need want a sniper or do I want like big fucking guns and a sword? This person's like staying. You want both, but yes, <laughs> that's the that's the that's the challenge. At least I can build items from here. Um, and also, who has what? So too too many kits, two things here. Um. It depends what we what we've got going on, you see, and uh, I don't know really what I'm walking into. Exactly. Uh, the mission description just sounded invest like investigate. There's no hostages involved, but at least we hope. Difficulty is difficult though, isn't it? Hmm. Well, yeah, that's a good point. So is this a case of bumping up a little bit? Um. Can I give Johnny a med kit just in case? Sword. Oh no, allow that. That's not what I wanted. Um, uh, uh, um, if I. So. So, this person's a specialist who's got the gremlin thingy, so they can be my ranged person. If I swap that out for like someone else. Oh, that's another great idea. Oh, Squaddy. He's a sharpshooter. And he's a mm -hmm. Squaddy, so that's fine. She's a corporal. And she's a big fucking cannon thing. Oops. I didn't mean to click that. So if I if I drop Starbucks and swap for another um Oh <laughs> this guy who's like shaken. Hopefully we can win and then he won't be shaken anymore. That is one way to cure it, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Uh, but the problem is, there's a very small chance that he'll freak out during the mission and not do an action. Oh, has he got? He just got a hell of a load of grenades. He can't carry any other medkits on that. In can you carry a medkit? 
Do I not have any med kits? Oh, bloody hell, XCOM. Yeah, it says you've got three. Oh, right, you're carrying all three. So if I give you a med kit. There right, we go. Okay. okay, well, here we go. He looks a bit sad, double guy on the right. Squaddy Williams. I, I, I mean, I haven't really heard enough of this game because I've mostly been watching it through this little window. But I, I remember this screen having really awesome music. In it. Yeah, it is quite um, stirring. Kind of like, we're launching into, we're going to win this mission yeah, yeah. type Hoo -ah. thing. Hoo -ah. <laughs> oh, this is going well. Alright, here we go. Um, Operation Tomb Hand. <laughs> Should brought Katie in with her all our Tomb Raider experience. <laughs> oh, we're up to five viewers. Okay, extract oh, all dude. XCOM soldiers. Recover, recover any value. Is Twitch not showing us viewers again? Uh, it is showing us viewers, but the other two numbers are being countered oh, correctly. I see. So I don't know. We sure it's not just us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe it's just. Oh, wait, I should include the moderators on that count. Maybe it's thinking. Um, all right, so it was recover any valuable information and extract all XCOM soldiers. Okay, so it's the standard. Yeah, just standard, just the standard mission. Uh, right. Let's let's be a bitch. I was gonna save, but. <laughs> oh man. Okay. Oh, what was that? Was that a flare or something? Yeah, that's our escape. Oh right. Okay. Yes. Um. Okay. So let's save scum. Indeed. I approve. <laughs> and now let's return to the game. Okay, so there's all of this shit over here. Oh, that's the edge of the field. There. Oh my god, this is huge. Um, we're on top of a building. <laughs> and we need to get all the way over here, which is promising. Which is because it's not oh, only that looks proper building, underground. It's that. down below. <laughs> <sighs> right. Okay. Um, is there a way across? Tonight. Yeah, this could be one big mission, and then we just and then we just finish the stream, <laughs> and I lie down and cry for half an hour. <laughs> um, right. Um, you go here. Oops, I'm getting pinged. Mm. Uh, ah, never mind. Just someone asking me to play Overwatch. Oh, I see. <laughs> We've got our own Overwatching to do. <laughs> A different kind. Oh, I don't really want to leave anyone, like, out of cover. Hmm. I feel you. Um, it's worth as well saying that at least um, there's no turn counter yet. Oh, sure, you've got time to just investigate. Yeah. Nope, alien activity. Uh, it's coming from unknown parts. Okay. <laughs> We have to come down, don't we? Yeah, we have to. Oh, I don't really want to come down. Let's just try and reveal more of the map. Getting it done. Getting it done. Got a group of hostiles over here. Okay. All right. Okay, we can see some of them now. Okay, we're still concealed though, so. I thought that was one giant health bar in there. Did you see that? No, I didn't. Oh, 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 I was about to say. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> okay, so we're still concealed, which is a good thing. So that'll give you advantage on attack. Um, yeah, and also we can just stay the hell away <laughs> for at least a little bit. Um. <coughs> uh, 
Um, if you go go here. Be espionage. Yeah, just for a little bit. Um, I know I know that all hell will break loose at some point, but I don't want it to break loose yet. Quite yet, yeah. Although how Johnny stays concealed in his fucking bright red. <laughs> Okay, so they're, they're, Look at me. they're off patrolling somewhere. Oh, okay. Oh, we're going to have to come down. But then over here... Oh, no, there's still plenty of cover over here. She says, hopefully. <laughs> full of hope. So full of hope. XCOM Springs Eternal. Yeah, XCOM Springs Eternal. Drop. Hide. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Okay, so that's opened that up. So that's good. Um. Shh! Land quietly, damn it! <laughs> <laughs> You find barrels up here. Uh, bodies, the containers, the trains. Aliens still abducting people. They may never have stopped after the invasion. <gasps> Those scumbags! Okay. Oh, don't don't tell me I have to rescue them. I really don't want to have to rescue them. I mean, like, I'm really sad that they're, like, you know, captured and all that, but... <laughs> <laughs> it's probably a bit you're, too you're, much to handle really at this point. <laughs> you're really convincing me there, really. <laughs> um, okay, so... Oh, is there anywhere else that would be a sensible place to go? The aliens... Where were they hanging for a second? They were over on the left. This left? Yeah, yeah, down there, down a bit further left, actually. Like they in were that like belt. here, weren't they? Yeah. In this in this tower thing here. That tower, yeah. Okay, so they've kind of gone off around here. But that's the boundaries. That's the edge of the map. Yeah. So, is there anywhere that is okay to sit for this guy to sit? Not really. <laughs> Have I got a whole bunch of Australians with me? <laughs> I think I do have a whole bunch of Australians with me. Um, I see you know how to play knifey spoony. <laughs> see you played knifey spoony before. <laughs> <laughs> what's that? What's that Crash Bandicoot game that Lisa plays? Uh... Oh, it's called Dash Dingo. Dash Dingo. <laughs> okay. Oh, this is ominous. Um. So there's all of that, and I will break concealment if I go there. So maybe if you go here, can you go here? Oh, that, that's so funny. Oh, I've forgotten how funny that was. Sorry. No worries. Need something to break the tension. It's fine. <laughs> Alright, okay. Two guys, snake. Okay, so we've got at least like seven odd people. Oh, it has that turrets! Oh my god, turrets! I wonder what the range is on those. Uh, also, I guess, I guess the stasis cells are a way of forcing you to evaluate whether it's safe to throw a grenade. Yeah. Because you might damage those. Uh, I can't go up because the build, the that's all red. So it's not, yeah, it's not even as if I could go up. Can I go in? Not without breaking concealment. She's in a stupid place now. <laughs> um, uh, shit is going to hit the fan very, very quickly. I wonder whether it's just better to just start the fight, but be mm. up, but be up high. Yeah, have high, high advantage, yeah. <sighs>
Mm. Okay, so now she's in a completely stupid place. Um, so I'm just going to have to put her somewhere relatively safer. <laughs> there is nowhere! Oh god! Re relatively. Oh god! <laughs> um, oh my god, there's nowhere. Okay, can I put her back up here? No, that would be stupid. I don't want to bunch them too much together. But then I don't know where those guys on the left are. They're like down here somewhere. So I can't move her there. Where where did um where did one guy and two snakes go? They were right in the center, yeah. Maybe they are on a patrol and until they notice you they will just keep patrolling. I'm like, do I move her there, or do I just move her up here and start the fight? Oh, decisions, decisions. Oh, she could even go inside the building, but then that's all. That would break concealment anyway. I kind of want to break concealment by just like firing on them. <laughs> <laughs> like if we're gonna, you get, you get an attack advantage for that, don't you? Yeah, I guess so. Because it's almost like you know, if we're gonna break it, we're gonna break it in style, you know. Yeah. I'm gonna do something wrong, do it right. Yeah, exactly. Advent has expanded their rail network to touch every city center they've built. Is this about Advent? This like yeah. This looks like the end of the line, at least for this area. Um, okay, so, but her... Oh, I can't move her yet. Ninety five percent yo! But even okay. take... Can't miss. Can't miss. Um, let's take this one because then he'd take him out completely. Okay. I think. Wish me luck. Oh, <laughs> Enemy destroyed. Did they notice? Yes, they noticed. <laughs> Got promotion though. Hell yeah, you got a promotion. Alright, you're starting, you're starting! Okay. <laughs> Mr. Big Fucking Gun over here. Can I control thingy on the ground yet? No, I can't. Oh, 53% terrible. Alright. Bing, bing, bing. Okay, now where's the rest? Fortune favors the bold. Oh, are they moving? Alright, so there's at least two there. If not three. Okay, so they're going for this bitch. I knew she was in a stupid position. <laughs> She, didn't oh, she can move now, she can move now. So run, baby, run. Fifty-six. <laughs> oh, let's do it, let's do it better than nothing. Yes. Yeah, it took him out. Oh, he did. Nice. So have exactly four health. He did. Excellent. Um, so, where's the other guy? He's like... Where's the other guy? He was like there, wasn't he? There were two, right? There were two. Absolutely. One of them must have went inside or has just went out of conceal into concealment range. But, but actually, wait. No, you're, there's no concealment range anymore. I guess fog of war is what I mean. We want to move away from this building. I also pasted the uh, Dash Dingo quote in the chat. Nice. Foolish Dingo, you must find and devour the seven crystal babies or spend eternity trying to <laughs> deep didgeridoo. <laughs> I forgot about that. Yeah. Um, and like Lisa, Lisa's like, I am so scared. And then it cuts to like, you know, later in the episode and she's completely addicted to it. <laughs> Okay. 
There he is. Hello. Say hello to my little friend. Oh, five damage. Oh, so close. You didn't take him out though. Yeah, On the plus side, if they win this mission, he'll be gravely wounded. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Johnny, tell me you can hit that. Nice. Yeah, what a boss. Okay. Okay, okay. Now what, now what, now what? Um, we have no choice but to kind of leave safety and head into the breach. Yeah. I don't like this. I really don't like this. I like our little vantage point up here. I do like your little safety on the roof. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> no. <laughs> Hold on a second. BRB screen up. No problem. I'll keep everybody entertained. Dingo. Ralph presses the E button on a keyboard spelling the word cat. I'm learning. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Super Nintendo Chalmers. Now I'm just reading quotes from that episode. Right, I am here. Give me a second. Right. Everyone okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just um, delivery. I oh, was well. just reading Ralph saying, Hi, Lisa. Hi, Super Nintendo Chalmers. <laughs> Super Nintendo Chalmers. Oh, shit. I forgot about that. Who am I? Who am I meeting? And he's playing a ColecoVision in that episode. Oh. Hell's cat. It's like, they couldn't even afford Commodore 64s, so they got a ColecoVision instead. <laughs> A anything exciting delivered? Um, I don't know actually. What is it? I don't know. It's in the cardboard thing. It, it just seems to have been wrapped in like 50 million layers of cardboard. It's the um. I'm all over it. <laughs> Oops, here we go. Ah! 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 Oh! 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 Okay, that's just to r remind you that it's there, I guess. <laughs> So that's Johnny, isn't it? So, but what? But I can't tell like where it all, how far it all, how far it all go. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, we don't know its range. Yeah. Maybe I'll do some reconnaissance. <laughs> some good old Google food. They are mm. vulnerable to hacking. Hmm. I should have sent my specialist forward. Yeah. Um, Johnny can't hack for shit, I don't think. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, let's go. Where should we put you? Where should we put you, Johnny? Fuck it, let's put you next to this guy. I don't have exact numbers for range, it's just described as long range, fairly high accuracy. What's that? It's real light for my car. Oh, right. Um, where am I going? If I put... On it. 
I really don't want to leave this rooftop. <laughs> <laughs> well, we've got a TV here, an internet connection. I know, right? Um, <laughs> oh, I can't move just yet. Does it work on like multiple levels like the turret thing? Uh let's see. Um Yes. But you can disable its height advantage somehow. Hang on. Often the structures they are placed on can be destroyed from beneath them, which also destroys the turret when it falls through. Okay. Taking these out in combat can earn a chance to upgrade the defense matrix in the Avenger. Huh. So you can salvage something from it, I think. Uh, it does not move, move, so it can shoot twice per turn instead. Yikes. Ouch. So. And it automatically gains an accuracy bonus when elevated. Well, that's not fair. <laughs> <laughs> Um, let's see. PSA. If you are bad at the early game like me, do not let the bonus health for Advent Dark Event complete. It makes the standard Advent Trooper go from heal 3 health to 5, 6 health. My god! Good thing yeah. that we didn't let that finish. Yeah, okay. I think we're safe, but yeah, that would have been, that would have been bad. There they are! Hey, sneaky! I don't really see much of the snakes in action because you usually get them before they get to you. Yeah. Um, I'm not willing to really give you much s snake in action. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's put Overwatch on this guy. Oh, he's going to take a pot. Oh! Oh, cheeky. Grab failed. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, thanks for that, you bitch. Is he poisoned? Do it, 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 do it. Yes! Oh, nice. Nice. So satisfying. I knew it was good to stay up on the fucking roof. Who would have thought it? Snipers working on a roof. Oh, Johnny, you lucky bastard. Okay. You, you call him something else in Glasgow, starting with Jammy. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, you can. Mm hmm. 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 That's a consideration. Hmm. Yeah, let's do it. Cause then. Oh, oh, that's that's outstanding. Did that finish it off? Yeah. Oh, one shot. Okay, come on, baby, you can do it. You're doing so well. God damn it! <laughs> <laughs> the oh. RNG had to be a little cruel, so we were doing too yeah, well. Yeah, we were doing too well. Um, you can't see shit, can you? <laughs> <laughs> um, Guys, I'm just sort of in the middle of this trench. Um, you can only try and fire at that guy. Oh, you have like no weapons, so. Yeah, yeah, there's really not many options there. Will that get both of them? Here, catch! Here, catch! He said. Nice. Oh. oh! But also, I may have blown up. You may have. <laughs> like, a Maybe person. A may have damage. killed a person. That happens in war. Not one of our guys. 
Oh, you're gonna go slash the snake? He tried to tongue him! <laughs> <laughs> Watcha! Oh, and a body to collect. Nailed him, he says. Whoa, would you look at that? <laughs> a rerium core and an advanced laser sight. Nice. Okay. He's like, I'll take Got that. The Got the goods! <laughs> Okay, so we've got more alien activity going. Yeah. Okay, we're doing well, so let's just push on into the facility. There'll be more inside, no doubt. Um, oh, I'm sorry, baby, you have to come down. <laughs> oh, my. No! <laughs> my vantage point! I know. Oh, you did so well. Um, you should probably reload. Yeah, that seems far, yeah. Um, good, to go. good to go, he says. Okay, cool. So, can we move you? We've got that ominous cloud there, which is, which is poisonous. There but these people, armor. They, were, um, they were immune to poison, which was um, pretty interesting. That's handy. Yeah. I was going to say, there's a full armor there next to that post. Yeah. All right. Is Johnny gonna breach? Press yeah. X to breach. <laughs> I can't breach from any other. Moving to position. Is that an action? Like, is it? Does that end the turn? I hope not, because that would be. Because that would suck, right? That would suck sitting in front of an open door. Uh, I'll find out for you if you want. Position confirmed. Uh, let's see. XCOM 2. Does opening and closing a door cost action points? I guess they're referring to the old system. Uh, no, opening a do door doesn't cost a point either. Didn't okay. even know you could close the door, says someone else in the thread. No points needed. No yeah. points needed, okay. Everyone talking about AP is probably referring to... They're probably veteran UFO slash XCOM players, because that's how the, the system works in the original games. Okay, here it goes. Oh. Oh. Ugh. Oh. That's a lot of sludge. Looks more like a refinery to me. Okay, they want the sample. You can't have the sample! <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Alright, so this is looking a bit more like one of the ships. Yeah. I'm, I'm not enjoying this, I must say. You're making progress though. Yeah, it's... But the tension is like ramping up, do you know what I mean? <laughs> Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! Alright, so we've got three in front. Well shit. Um, fire sniper rifle. <laughs> 11 percent. It doesn't look like And then he yeah, can't... Yeah, maybe try and get a little bit closer. But that was pretty funny. If that, would have, if that had hit, that would have been really great. But... Yeah, but I, I don't think... I think my luck probably would have run out. 39 percent. Ugh. It's ugly, it's ugly. Um, no. Johnny doesn't have any grenades, actually. Oh, okay. Although I think... Probably be too dangerous anyway in there. Yeah, it probably would be. <gasps> oh! Okay, okay. Five now. okay, okay. Okay, okay. Oh, okay, Overwatch! Oh, yeah, crap! <laughs> <laughs> I, can, I can tell you why that missed, Johnny. <laughs> Not even close, he said. Okay, I need to bring this fight outside. Yes. No, 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 no. Oh, come on. Ugh. How does I undo mind control? Ah, oh, damn it, Johnny. We're gonna have to pull back. Fire. 
Right, okay, so you, my girl, you need to come out of there. So, just run, run like hell, run like hell. Force them to come outside. Um, you, my love. Um, if you... You, need, you should pull back as well. But you should stay, stay back. Johnny has been hit, so... But is there anywhere else that he can go? Or can he take a pot shot? Oh no, I don't want to hurt my guy. Presumably I'd need to hurt the, kill the alien that's um, mind-controlling him. Uh, so normally, the way to avoid that... Oh, well, you, you obviously know about the shield thing. Uh, yeah. It, you can't manufacture enough of those yet. No. Um, I think if you kill the alien that's controlling them. Yeah, that's yeah. Oh shit. Oh, Missed. Oh, Alright. <sighs> ah! That is nasty. Oh, that is nasty. That is really uncool. I'm going to suggest making an additional save scum after this. Yeah. Should have saved scummed after that first um that first yeah. wave. Regretting that now. Oh, where's he gone? He's fucking disappeared as well. Oh my god, what is happening? Retreat, retreat. Retreat, retreat. That is an option if things get too hairy. Come on! Nice. Okay, one down. That would take some of it down. Or do I just straight up want him to retreat to the rooftop again? I feel like he needs that, to get yeah, he needs and out of there. Get him out. Abort. Yeah. Good to go. Oh. <sighs> All right. Oh, he has no fucking guns as well. Is that Rolo? No, it's not Rolo. It's, uh, you know, the guy who was shaken. Oh. Uh, that probably made him extra susceptible to mind control. Probably, yeah. Because he had a lower... That little bastard is staying way back, isn't he? Mm. Oh, you bringing thing back to life now? Oh, zombies as well. Mind control lost, okay. Fantastic, right. get out of there. Alright, so they're being suppressed, so there's a chance they'll get hit if they run. Okay. Let's see if you can do something. At least just take the robot down. It was a decent shot. Suppression uh, removed, but, um, yeah. Uh, did you make another save yet? Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, shit. I would make another one, because you still haven't lost anyone at this point. Yeah. <sighs> I 
But do it's not like, uh, like this. Looks like and Mistress Lilith and Sphere are still all with us. They're caught up in this drama. <laughs> and this is some this is some serious it's, it's, bullshit. It's drama, no, yeah. Oh, that is some serious bullshit. Look at that. Oh. Yeah, Man, I know you missed. You put me in here? I'm completely useless. No, you missed, you stupid bitch. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, you, Mr. Fucking Mind Control. Take down that fucking mech. Take something down at least. Oh, come god. on. So close. Oh, that would have been it. I know you need ammo, but yeah, so you're gonna have to reload. Back in. Yeah, I know you're back in. Um, Overwatch. Yeah. Oh, he did. He so did. We have our first confirmed kill. <gasps> or death, I should say. Because I'm really not sure about those first three. I think they're. What the fucking. <laughs> you could reload. I could reload. Is that, is that a bitch thing to do? Should I just. Ah! Should I just take it? Well, maybe you should use this opportunity. Let's to, just like, learn. Let's use yeah. this as a learning experience. And use then this as a learning experience. And if it goes tragically wrong, still, or even not satisfyingly enough. Okay, <laughs> next time we are not coming through the front door. We are going <laughs> by the side, which is what we should have. Which is what we should have done in the first place. You didn't know. You didn't know. But now you know. Okay, so I got that guy's heavy breathing in my ear. <laughs> He's like a little bit panicked. Can we at least take out the mech? <laughs> <laughs> um, so, oh, so, fifty percent on the sectoid, eighty-four on eighty-four on the zombie and the mech. Can you grenade? Um, this girl doesn't have any grenades. Nope. Who does anyone have grenades? If you slash. You would take out so that could take theoretically. I could take out two if I was lucky with those two people. This guy's fucking useless, and the other guy is dead. So uh, I don't want to, but if I pull her back at least a little bit, and then I know it compromises. Um, I know it compromises her um, aim, but. You want the extra cover. I want the distance. extra cover, yeah. yeah. So once we take down the mech, the mech is gone. It can't be reanimated. Um, we really uh, need to take out that fucking sectoid in there. The no? sectoid is gonna keep. Threat. It's gonna keep um, going. Thank you, God. Lop. Lop. Hurt your guy next to you. <laughs> Oh, Johnny can't, um, Johnny can't do anything from there. Okay. He's too protected. He's too protected. The sect toy that range. Oh no, I got him! Good. It's stuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. Oof. Oh, there's another one? Jesus. No, 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 no. Give me a hug. Oh, no! <laughs> okay, I may be reloading. 
download time now. And now your panic is removed. Oh, fuck this. He oh, just got a last minute, like, thing of adrenaline, like, oh, I'm the only one, look, I've got to, I've got to do this. Oh my god. Shall I scum, shall I scum the seconds? I, 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 for the purposes of this run, in particular, I think we should allow it, but, um... I mean, we're not playing on hard, we're not playing on, uh, Iron Man, we're just trying to get through the game first time. That was terrible. That was well. We had in this run. We had to have at least one mission go batshit insane. Yep. It would go completely. Oh crap! You died valiantly in the darkest timeline, Johnny. You died valiantly. <laughs> Killed by a zombie alien. Oh, well, at least got a sniper. Right? time travel right now, and. Okay, so what was happening here? I can't remember. Uh, <laughs> you're, you need to get your sniper out of the way. Uh, where's my uh, sniper? On the roof. I can't... I can't move him at the moment. Oh, right, okay. Uh, well, you need to perhaps set up Johnny to overwatch whoever was going to snipe the sniper. Um, I'm gonna move Johnny back a bit more, and then he's gonna reload, because he has no weapons. Okay. <coughs> Bless you. Um, thank you. Scotty Thomas Williams can run the fuck away. Yeah. Um. Oh, there's my sniper. He's alive! Um, this chick can also run the fuck away. Is she under too much protection from this, uh, this angle? Dramatic angle. Oh no! Oh no, there's another turret! <laughs> Is that gonna be, say, another turret? Please don't say there's another turret. Okay. Wait, what? Ah! Wait, what's that was going on? <gasps> no! There was one in stealth! <laughs> <laughs> I'm straight back to reload. No! <laughs> wow. That was really bad. <laughs> that was so awful. <laughs> um, if we maybe try and push the battle to the left hand side of the building. Yeah, yeah. Um, rather so than the middle. It's turning into live, die, repeat. Basically. Um, Till we get this right. <laughs> Till I get this right, yeah. Get right, Tom Cruise. Uh, unless this is triggered at a game? Right, let's let's push the battle over here. And you Now remember there was a guy on the left that is the one that took out your sniper. Yeah, he comes he circled round in a side. Look at that bitch reload. Tis but a flesh wind. Okay, so the sectoid is visible. And uh, he's gonna mind control my guy. Oh my god, that's some hell of a range. And there's the gentleman who... Okay, at least that missed. <sighs> we were doing so well. <laughs> I think this is still salvageable, but it's going to take quite a lot of luck and possibly reloading. Fuck okay. that! How far can he move? Gotta get rid of that sectoid. Gotta get rid of that Oh, what's he going to do? Is he gonna he's going to shoot, gonna shoot at this, this girl. Oh no, he's he seems 
No, I have control of him. Right. Oh no, I have control of her. You have control. Oh my god. There is there is no way. There's just no way. <laughs> She's got ice. Uh, we're getting some advice in the chat. Oh, okay. From, I will take uh, all advice. From Lunaris Paradox. And play next XCOM, nowhere is safe. I know. <laughs> That's less advice and more of an absolute statement. Um, thanks okay. for that, PSA. <laughs> <laughs> um, she is not in a good spot. No. So let's just flee. Flee like the wind. I need to kill that fucking sectoid. I think you may have advanced too quickly. Well, what yeah, happened? I think uh, so. Luna, I don't know how long you've been in here, Luna. Uh, but earlier it seemed like it was going really well, and at that point we may have advanced too aggressively. But yeah, no. What happened is that I went through the front door. Should ne never go through the front door. Should have gone via the side because I opened the front door and had put soldiers inside. Then, then all of them came outside, started coming, started coming towards the door, and then that fucking sectoid. Yeah, <laughs> yeah basically. Um, basically. Yes, you just got here. Okay, so yeah, that you're you're pretty accurate though, Luna. So uh, we're, we're getting there though. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. We're getting there. Oh, he's he's um, oops, he's pretty in pretty bad shape, but he's holding a mid kit, so heal up. Yeah. Can you heal up an overwatch? Um, I don't know if he can. I think it's... Or oh, can he? Oh, no, he can. He, ooh, he can heal and fire. Um, so we to take the mech, take the zombie. Uh, Luna says, welcome to XCOM Commander. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> it's really kicked off now, yeah. Oh, shit's hitting the fan. Um... Take a zombie, he, the fucking sectoid is just going to reanimate him again, so I'm like, which do I go for? I take out the- I, that won't take out the mech because he's still got one armor, hasn't he? The mech's annoying, but it's ultimately just a tank. Mm. In terms of, like, it's not putting out as much DPS as the sectoid effectively is. Because the sectoid is screwed with everything. What did the odds look like on everyone else? Oh no, Donnie is the last one to move. Ah. <sighs> Welcome to XCOM, where it's not about how well you survive, but how spectacularly you explode. I'll take, I'll take that. You know. <laughs> um, I need to kill that goddamn sectoid. But let's go for, let's go for. All right. Okay, that's fair enough. Than the last fair time. enough. Um. Okay, now here we go. Oh. Oh. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> okay. I never thought your sniper would be in so much danger, but. I know. Uh -oh. oh, hello. Oh! <gasps> Okay. Oh, come out and play, little bitch. God damn it! What just happened? Oh, you like. F take the. F Did he fall through the building? Is he dead? I think he fell oh, through the no, it sounds like he's dead. There was like gargling noises and. Oh, 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 oh. Heavy fire in this zone. oh shit. My, my sniper is not. is destined to not survive this, is he? Oh. And how many how many spaces does this damn zombie have? This the is so unfair. Be, uh... Okay, check your 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 dude who gargled. Oh yeah, no, I think I think he's dead. You think we lost him? Okay. I think we lost him. Yeah. At a certain yeah. point, it's up to you whether to take that sacrifice because we could. Because we could, yeah. Well, I don't know. We were doing so well, you know. <laughs> Luna says, "I may be wrong, but I think this mission may be a bust. We'll show you." Uh, no, I think I think we are pretty much gonna <laughs> we can fuck this one. 
Um, got too cocky at the start, I think. It was going really well at the beginning. It was going fantastically, wasn't it? Um, so he would 100% kill that shit. Um, where's my other squad person? Ah, oh, she can't, she can't shoot from there. She's too well covered. If she went over here, I just want to kill that goddamn sectoid. Oh, that's a true. Oh, she can't. Uh, oh, 44%. Terrible. And that wouldn't even kill it. I think, yeah, this is this is such a bust, isn't it? This is like the real uh, bust. Is this an abort mission? Uh, we've, it still might, we've, we've still got save. We've still got save. I've still got save, so what I'd have to do is probably just quit and then, like, quit, quit and then um, reload from the very beginning. But that was. This is terrible. This is going so badly. I mean, is there an autosave earlier in the mission? Like, if you check the timestamps. Yeah. So, that was the... Oh, that was the autosave when everything was safe and we hadn't embarked on this mission. <laughs> and there's one where we're just starting the mission. The save scum one. Um, save scum one is yeah where we just started this mission. Um, auto save is probably when it just went really bad, started going really bad. <laughs> yeah, because save scum two is at eight fourteen p.m. So, <sighs> so save scum two was the most recent save. Was the most recent save? Made. Yeah. So that seven forty one is our is best our chance. is our best chance. What do you reckon? Should I go back to? Because that's like. How long has this been going? What, like an hour and a bit? So that, that yeah, tanks like an hour and a bit of work, doesn't it? But uh, Luna says going back to auto saves is always an option. Yeah, we sorry we just missed that. Yeah. Um, um, pro tip: the primary function of grenades is smashing both cover and walls. Yeah, no, I appreciate that. I guess that. that's true for like fall damage and stuff. Then I guess that's what happened to our friend. Yeah, I don't know what to do you now. I would, uh, if it was me, I would probably just the, give give the safe scum one a chance, and if that's, because uh, I think I think we are kind of screwed at this point. We are like properly screwed, aren't we? Okay. Uh, safe scum one may not be too far in, or maybe the very beginning of the mission. I can't remember. <laughs> it seems like so long ago. <laughs> Remember those days when you had a full squad? Oh, those sweet sweet halcyon days when my sniper shot everything. Okay. Yep. It's yeah, this is right mission. at the start. All right, let's just have to do the stuff in the field uh, in the XCOM base again. I glimpsed the darkest timeline and I didn't like it. <laughs> <laughs> pull out! Pull out! Uh, well, it's up to you. You can make a save here, uh, like a proper save, not an auto save. Um, although I guess save some one wasn't an auto save. Um, and uh, we can come back next time if you want. Uh, um, or we can keep going, it's up to you. Let, let me do like the first bit and then I can... Um... Yeah, I get to the point where we beat the first wave. Why would you go that way? <laughs> because... <laughs> I don't know, pathfinding? <sighs> Only the first person to move should enter new territory. Yeah, that's also a good tip. That's also true. So, from what I remember, there's a bunch of guys in the tower to the bottom left. Well, not yeah. much, there are two. There are two here. There are two here. Yeah. Because um, killing those two was what kicked everything off. So once you cleared them two and them two, things died down for a bit. So if I try and get to that point... Yeah. Um. Why would you go that way? Yeah, they're just getting their their uh, their core training in. <laughs> work on them abs. Uh, so let's station my sniper here. Ooh, look at all this stuff that's opened up. 
All the bodies. These containers look like they blah 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 blah. It's the matrix, etc., etc., etc. Batteries. Um, last thing you want is to find more enemies with your last soldier. Yeah, no, definitely. Yeah. That's a really good. That's a really good thing to remember. Um, Squaddy Thomas Williams, Mister, I get scared easily. Mister, mind controlled. Mister, I'll buck up and get courage once everyone died. Yeah. Stepping off. I wonder if we should, um, because we're still under concealment. I wonder if we should just. Just try, just try to go in. <laughs> or is that a completely bananas plan? I think that might be a completely bananas plan. Um. Hmm. Oh no, I, I know that those guys are there though, don't I? So I could do what I did last time and just take them out. Let's 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 proceed with caution. Don't be stupid. <sighs> I was like, let's make a run for the side door! <laughs> like where everybody is. <laughs> yeah, trying to sneak past is a really good idea. If a guy sees you suddenly you are surrounded. Yeah, that's true. Don't get hit and you won't die. This has been your helpful tip from Luna's Paradox. <laughs> <laughs> Bing. <laughs> um, okay. I remember um, Gary Witter, who is uh, who was the writer on Star Wars uh, Rogue One. Uh, used to hang around uh, the Whiskey Media offices, aka what where Giant Bob used to be located. Mm -hmm. like, um, and he used to so he used to pop into like Giant Bob and test it, comic night. Uh, and I remember him dropping in for some Team Fortress 2 streams. And his advice was always shoot that guy. <laughs> shoot that guy! Get like, that guy! <laughs> yeah, 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 basically that. And like, I remember all of a sudden the, the person who was playing started doing better and he was like, see? <laughs> Listen to my expert advice. <laughs> Pro TF2 tips. Shoot that guy. Too far away to shoot right now. Oh, although, ah, oh, this skin, this fun times again. Let's take out the trooper. Well, attempt to anyway. Nice. I like. I like a six. Is that, uh, is that a kill? Yeah, it was a kill. Right, you getting that sexoid? Yeah. I see. I feel like we're seeing the world from a completely different perspective now. <laughs> I, know, I know... Yeah, so, I thought the camera angle there was the main building, but turned around, but it's not, it's a different building. Mm. Remember to set some people in Overwatch first. Yeah, we've been using Overwatch quite a... Uh, nice! Uh, Is it going to go down? No? Oh yeah, yeah no, because it's still got one thing standing. With ambushes, you could get some shots on the Ethectoid before he grabs cover. Um... Oh, so close! Yeah, I didn't get it. Yeah, I know you didn't. Come and get some. <laughs> Point. 
Oh, he running away. Oh. I see you. <laughs> we can still see your health bar. He definitely can't see him, can he? Yeah. No, because he's run away. On the move. I'm just posting pictures of Gary Whittle in the chat now. 29%, <laughs> that's terrible odds. Grenade any better? Oh no. No, I don't want to use my grenades grenade. just yet. And it's too early, yeah. Yeah, it's too early. Oh, it was... I knew that was stupid, but whatevs. With the pistol? Does he have a pistol? I'm drawing ammo. Yeah. Are we going to get lucky a second time? Yes. And then some Undertale text pops up and it says you feel like you've seen his dead body before. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> um, okay, so let's save here. Yes, that's a good idea. Um, let's overwrite save scum 2 because that was just... That's a lost cause. <laughs> that, was just, that was just bullshit. <laughs> right, um, okay, who have I got now? I've got Johnny. And I've got those two guys floating around around here, haven't I? So if Johnny comes over here, Solid copy. yeah, there they are. Oh, Need to find some new cover. oh no! Oh. oh, I wasn't expecting that. Okay, brave. Um, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Well, let's get Yon Sniper the fuck out of there. Is there anywhere that offers full cover? Yes, yes, Central, this is not the time! <sighs> Commander, we got a new delivery from Amazon. Oh wait, sorry Commander, it's actually addressed to me. To <laughs> oh, that was risky. This is our roof! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Get out of it! <laughs> um. Is there any way you can eliminate the two enemies this turn? Uh, unless you're talking about a grenade. Um, uh, we're, we're keeping the, we were trying to keep the grenades for later, though. Yeah, because shit hits the fan later, doesn't it? And we used them up maybe a bit too early last time. Yeah. Although, that, there was that one grenade toss that was pretty good early on. Yeah, it was pretty good. Go on, I, I want to see this just go. Yes! Oh yeah. no! I it didn't get that. him. It didn't get him, get him. He might run away though. He I mean, might. it's not ideal, but it's better than him attacking you. Yeah, he's he running away. Inside. Going for a wee nap? Go for a wee nap. <laughs> <laughs> get a wee kip! <laughs> that's not cover, that's not cover. Um, get my sniper far, far away from. Please, love of God, let there be nothing in this building. Uh, Lunar says, careful, he's on Overwatch. Is he? Oh, yeah. Yeah, 
He's on Thanks for the heads up. Thank you. Is um, that an icon that pops up? Yeah, look look at his. He's got like a little eye. Oh, I see now, yeah. Okay. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. Um, this is my sniper guy, so... Will he be able to see him from there? No. But let's, let's put you even further back. Oh shit! <laughs> It's 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 a Cobra Commander. It's happening. <laughs> yep. Um. Oh, that is not what I wanted to happen. Um. So he's on Overwatch. Them bitches have come out to play. Um. Uh, Luna is saying. Don't take your sniper into new territory. What do you yeah. mean? Sniper was completely fine last night. <laughs> no, that was me being stupid. I shouldn't have done that. Um, uh, I just want to take that guy out, you know? Is that too much yeah, to ask? Yeah, it's kind of a, like an annoying bug that's... Actually, I'm the guy who takes spiders and puts them outside, but still. Um... That's, this is a stupid place to put Johnny. But I, like I want to draw him out and yeah, <sighs> you just get set Overwatch and wait until he comes out. Like you just sort of back against the wall. Like eh, I'll shoot you if you come out the door. Ah, oh, you little bitch! Oh, critical! But I don't know. I hope there was going to be a return fire there. Sword would work. Oh, nice! That's a good shot. That was a good Almost shot. Almost took out the snake, man. Oh my god! What the hell? <laughs> That's a hell of a range. That is a hell of a range. Wow, yeah, Lu you're right, Luna. I just totally should not have sent my sniper anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> anywhere near safe. still get safe scum, too. Oh, that was dreadful. Dreadful. I should have been patient, stayed where I was. If it has one HP, do what you can to kill it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. <sighs> Fucking fuck. Uh, so Luna, can we take it you're a bit of a veteran of this one? Uh, we played a fair amount of Enemy Unknown, but uh, kind of new to this one. Uh, yeah, you hang on that wall, bitch. <laughs> yeah, ragdoll physics, go! <laughs> Um, hello? Nice, yes, good. Uh, I told this story last stream, but uh, basically I had UFO slash original XCOM on the Amiga for years uh, as a child, but I didn't understand that you could go off of the map screen, which, is, which was just a rotating globe. So I didn't know what the game was, because <laughs> there's so much you have to do before you can land the first time and set up a squad and all that. Um, I've played my fair share of XCOM 2, okay. Well, that didn't feel good, he says. Oh, well, I feel, I feel like, I feel like my sniper is destined to die in this playthrough, nope. you know? Freedom! <laughs> Alright, so Bound doesn't kill your guy, it just traps him? I'm guessing, but he's he's like, uh, this doesn't feel good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not into this. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Enemy down. Got no ammo. Okay. Johnny is like all the way over there. Okay, so, so Luna is confirming that if you shoot the snake, the grabbed unit gets to move. Okay then. I was worried about that. I didn't know if that would hurt you. Oh! It's over. Well, at least he's hunkering down and not shooting at everyone. <laughs> oh. oh, damn you, you snake! Oh, <laughs> commander! 
Yeah, the point of the snake is to drag your team out of position. Well, he fucking certainly did that, didn't he? <sighs> Stop panicking! Thank you. <laughs> right, um... I need to kill that goddamn snake. Well, that's hilarious. What? Uh, remember how I was just the second talking about UFO slash original XCOM? Mm -hmm. Humble just sent me uh, an email saying that it's currently XCOM UFO Defense or UFO yeah, 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 yeah. It's currently free on the Humble store right now. The original 1983 mm -hmm. Amiga slash PC game. Uh, that's cool. You should pick that up if you haven't already. Um, I think like, I think I have it on um in my library. I think okay. I've got it on on Steam, yeah. Okay, Pilgrim, what do you reckon? Oh, Chase the goodness. snake. Why did it get have revenge. to be snakes? <laughs> yeah, get revenge for snake eater. <laughs> that was that range though. I know, that was awful. You remember last time we were lucky last playthrough because he tried to tongue him and um, he missed. Yeah. I so, didn't realise it would, I thought it would just like poison you or something. I didn't think it would pull you across the map. Yeah. Um. Okay, so you're not panicking anymore, which is good. Um. You're taking it slower now. Yeah. Uh, Luna says they would heal up first. Yeah. Which is, yeah. Uh, Tasmo Khan is talking about uh, the Long War mod. We discussed that last week, actually, uh, Tasmo. Um, <laughs> if you do that, then yeah, death will be swift. <laughs> we we did notice that uh, Long War 2 uh, came out for XCOM 2 as well. Uh, but we did talk about uh, XCOM 1's version of Long War. Uh, hey, hey, Susan and Scott and chat. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. Um... You're a Twitch Turbo. Well, Twitch Prime, as it's called now, but you know, whatever. Same thing. I've still got that to spend. Have you? Do you still have that to spend? Like, are you a Prime subscriber? Me? Yeah. No. No, okay. I'm a Prime subscriber because Mum, A, loves the instant video stuff because, you know, anything where I don't have to do uh, I mean, acquire videos uh, for her. Uh, and B, she loves the next day delivery, uh, so we, we go halfers on that every year. Um, so I've got I've got this Prime Twitch Prime sub to give to someone, but I keep I'm like should I give it to Daniel Dwyer? I'm like who do I, who do I really who do I think deserves it in terms of actually needs it? On the move. move to blue whenever possible. Yeah. Oh, so wait. Oh, Tasmacan is saying there is a version of Long War for the original UFO XCOM. Oh, really? Oh, I didn't, I didn't know that. That's cool. Man, that game's hard enough as it is. Okay, I don't know if I need don't know if you need UFO. any more to any yeah, more to make like, it worse. That that original XCOM is really tough. <laughs> Although it does, it does have. There's one. There's a couple of advantages of original UFO and XCOM have over the remake, uh, and it's stuff like you you actually have a couple of extra actions you can do, uh, sort of fancier maneuvers in terms of like hiding behind things and uh, and how you spend your AP um, instead of having move attack or move Overwatch or whatever you do in this, uh, you have an actual AP system of points. So you can theoretically get off like three shots in a turn, I think. Really? Yeah, but you'd have to have an insane amount of AP for that. But yeah, it's, it's theoretically possible, I guess. Original XCOM, where you open the door, Johnny panics, and everyone dies by rocket. <laughs> like, that sounds like original XCOM. Right? <laughs> you can 
build multiple bases. Yeah, yeah. I've heard to, I, um, I did, I did play original XCOM eventually, like, but it was way after I realized I had it on my media for like 10 years. Uh, I'm playing this really cautious. <laughs> We're not going to move for like six no, days. I'm, I'm <laughs> Especially after what happened last time. Come out, come out. For Lewis just joining us, uh, shit hit we did the this fan. mission <laughs> earlier in the stream, and it went really well until we defeated the first wave, and then we, then we got overwhelmed because we advanced a little too quickly. But so now we're overcompensating and we moving over like three really. inches per <laughs> turn. Yeah, but I don't want to move there. <laughs> Johnny comes out, gets shot while he ha have a proximity grenade to prep. He dies. Everybody dies. Mission over. Yeah, that, sounds la, 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 la. that sounds about right. Oh, uh, I have a PlayStation VR coming tomorrow or Wednesday too. Says uh, Lady Lola. Nice. Lord. Mistress Lola, I should say. Nice. Uh, that's cool. Uh, you got any games for it? Yeah, I was going to say, what are you going to play? What are you going like, to play? Resident Evil Seven seems to be the big. One of the big ones, or um, at least on PSVR, when it comes to like uh, the Vive, there's some different games. Oh, Pixel Spar has appeared. Hi, Pixel. It's uh, one of our MVPs. MVP, uh, MVP. <sighs> this sucks. This playthrough fucking sucks. Look at this. Look at this shit. As McCann says, RE7 is amazing on VR. Yeah, it, it does seem pretty cool. Uh, I'm a really, really big fan of Remake, the Resident Evil remake from 2002, which was recently released in HD. I think that's basically the peak of classic Resident Evil, and then Resident Evil 4 is the peak of action Resident Evil. Uh, also getting Until Dawn. Nice. Uh, I am a big fan of Until, Until Dawn. I still actually to break the seal on my own copy. I've just watched it like four times, like four complete playthroughs of other oh, people that I know. Oh, thanks Luna. Everybody's first XCOM playthrough sucks, don't worry about it. Yeah! <laughs> that makes XCOM con Constellation uh, Club. <laughs> uh, yeah, and I should see how badly my Enemy Unknown playthrough is going through. Is going because I wanted to play this while I was on, only play this while I was on stream. Yeah. So um, I was playing. Practice. I went. I went to put a practice with enemy unknown. I got to that, yeah. and I was saying earlier that I got to that mission where they first introduced like the zombifying thing, with those like, like your first city mission. Yeah, and there's like civilians everywhere, and they're camping out on rooftops and shit, and yeah. And you know, like the game is super unfair, where there's no way that you can rescue. Yeah, yeah, you're kind of is kind of intentional. It's making a point. Yeah. Um, but also, Drive Club, Batman. Cool. Uh, but yes, XCOM Two is an entirely different game. That's true. Uh, so just to clarify, me and Susan have both beat. Well, I, you came very, very close to beating Enemy Unknown, uh, and I did beat Enemy Unknown. Um, Tasmokan has been playing XCOM since 93. Really? Uh, and I can tell the RNG never gets old. <laughs> Pro tips. Never feels, never feels good when it happens to you, but someone goes through the... When it, someone goes through it, it just sets you up for an epic and classic moment. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, I, I get what you're saying. Like, that is the double-edged sword of RNG. I just want to kill that fucking snake. Where is that snake? <laughs> it's, it's like a revenge mission now. Yeah, <laughs> It's because I just don't want that snake to like pop up again. Luna is saying, just gotta say, and this is a minor spoiler for anyone who played original, uh, not original XCOM, uh, the XCOM 1 remake. Uh, I just gotta say, I love that so many people lost the first game that developers just made it cat. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, like I'm, I was really confused when I read the story synopsis for this, like the intro at least. I was like, hang on. But I, I beat. I, I want XCOM one. <laughs> yeah, What's this is on? this is the darkest timeline. Taz McCann says, "Get the snake, salty revenge confirmed." Yeah, salty revenge confirmed. I want that. <laughs> oh no! 
Oh, nice. Oh, okay, sure. With a shotgun, sure, why not? Did I kill it? Did I kill it? Oh shit, oh shit. Oh, there's that damn snake! He brought a robot with him! <laughs> <laughs> Overwatch! Shoot Did legs. I take it? Did I take it? Shoot, damn me all! Shoot! <laughs> oh. oh, snake to the snakening. <laughs> Luna says, final enemy of the game, 97% chance to hit, miss 80% chance to hit, miss my entire game. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Yeah. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Screw walls, who needs them? <laughs> I, know. <laughs> I know you're going to need to reload uh, soon, but let's, let's take out that goddamn steak. <laughs> Ah, revenge! Sweet, sweet revenge! Something grazed? Oh, that was bad. Uh, also, Luna is recommending. Gr hmm? Uh, Luna uh. is also recommending grenades soon because we're starting to get to points where you can like breach the walls and stuff. I guess that's why. That's true. I've seen a hundred. I just accidentally missed that shit. Salt was real that day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, everybody. You can't be one hundred percent. Let's <laughs> let's let's take a moment just to chill. Okay, make another save, maybe. Yeah, this is probably a good good time to save. Shall we call this save scum too? <laughs> With no, because no, but oh, uh, it's like do we take do we take the fact that the sniper died a horrible snake death? Yeah, I guess you can make the save scum three if you want, but uh, let's call it save scum three. Although we'll probably accept that our sniper is dead and gone. It, yeah. yeah. One casualty is bad, but you know, it's not as bad as like the entire fucking squad like it was last time. Ah, <laughs> uh, just... why don't you just chill there for a bit? Alien activity, oh okay, right. So... Whew. He's... he's fucking mind control bullshit, isn't he? Johnny is our best soldier. <laughs> Although don't tell him we said that. And Mistress Lilith also mentions that Psychonauts is getting a VR game. Is it? Uh, that sounds vaguely familiar now that you've mentioned that. I kind of forgot about it, but yeah. Yeah, because there was people, I remember people were like, hang on, why are you like trying to do get funding for Psychonauts 2, but you're also doing this VR thing or something? Like, yeah, I remember people complaining. Okay, that sounds about right. Move into Overwatch. <sighs> Everyone keeps going on about VR. All I want is a good split screen game. I love um, split screen as well. Yeah, like I mean, look, I'm, I'm, I want VR too. Remember those days when you split screen and your side of the screen was like this big? Oh, of course. <laughs> and back then we were all on like fourteen to twenty-one inch CRTs, so it was even smaller than what we're used to now. Yeah, you know, like your tiny little four. You probably got like what? If you've got a fourteen-inch screen, you divide that by four. You get, you get like three and a bit inches each to play Goldmine. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be on job. Uh, yeah, those were the days. So many <sighs> dun 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 dun! Dunking into the sludge. Dunking into the sludge. The good old burn screen days. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if you, if you kept, if you kept, um, if you did po leave it paused on a, like a white screen and kept speakers away from it, it'd be okay most yeah, of the time. Yeah, probably be alright. Yeah. But yeah, you're right. Screen burning was an issue. Struggle is real. Alright, so you're slowly advancing this time. I like it. Playing very, very cautious. What was the sniper's name? Because I, I, I was saying, you're doing it for snipe. Snipey. Snipey. Doing it for snipey. <laughs> I think his name was Goto, wasn't it? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. See, that's how much I cared about him. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Waiting for Goto? Oh, oh, oh terrible. Oh. Um. The only time a sniper can cry. <laughs> it's when it's all over, yeah. <laughs> um, 
I want you to stay on Overwatch. I like you there. So I'm I'm selling something on eBay right now, right? And uh -huh. it's got 11 hours left. Uh -huh. And I've just been watching the, you know, page views and watchers go up. Uh -huh. And I'm at, I'm at nine watchers, and I refreshed during the stream, and I went up to ten watchers, and I just uh -huh. refreshed again, and it went back down to nine. So uh, <laughs> I have to assume they just bought the same item from someone else. Interesting. I've still got my Boston acoustics from my old Gateway computer in 2001. Those speakers are amazing, but it's entirely awesome. Sniper old. number 539363. <laughs> you will be remembered for about five seconds. <laughs> it's so true. Oh, hi, Sniper. I hardly knew ye. <laughs> I took you on like four missions though, or some, or some bullshit like that. Oh man. Sniper number 01189988199911972533. I did just read that. Oh, oh, what was that joke that I heard today? That was so good. Um. Oh, what do you what do you call a snake that is exactly three point one four meters long? Oh, um, okay, something about pie. Uh, uh, I don't know. What do you call a snake that is exactly three point one? A pi a python. A python. I should have seen that coming. <laughs> Bob. His name was Bob. His name was indeed Bob. Oh, Bob, we hardly knew ye. <laughs> no, not ye. <laughs> Rolo's like, me? No? <laughs> well, our sniper Bob, who died an untimely death by snake. Now, don't you get mind controlled. I'll be so pissed if you get mind controlled. Okay. Python, yeah! Tasmacan, got it. What did you link? Oh, it's just a video from the IT crowd about that number I read out. Oh, right! <laughs> see, it's a replacement for 999. <laughs> Very good. Um. And then the granny keeps calling up and is like trying to put the numbers in and she keeps getting it wrong and she's like, I've had a bit of a tumble. Oh no. <laughs> Good coffee. Moving on target. It's like the second episode or something, it's great. Why would you go that way? Uh, let's see. Oh wow, really, Mistress Lilith? I imported Resident Evil Gun Survivor 1 from Japan because the US version doesn't have gun comm support because of Columbine. Wow. Oh wow, really? Uh, yes, why stop real guns when you can stop toy ones? Let's not get into politics here, although... I'm on the move. Um, uh, Lilith, would the PAL version not have worked? Although, I guess the PAL version has its own problems because of 50 hertz. God, I hate 50 hertz, but that's a separate rant. <laughs> Only good 50 hertz games are games that were coded from the ground up for 50 hertz, like old Amiga games. That's it. Everything else should be 60 hertz. Um. Are you just talking to break the tension now? <laughs> I was. A little bit. Also passionate about 15, 60 hertz, but. Uh... I think the only PAL games I have are Sega Master System. And Shemnu's 2's Dreamcast version. Yes, we did famously get the Dreamcast version. Holy shit! Oh, here they go. <sighs> Alright, so you're taking it slow. You're taking it slow. Oh, Sick man, boy why, first. why don't you snap me back to where I was?
Well, that's some proper bullshit, isn't it? 32%. You gonna pull back? What are you gonna do? Are those the I only mean, guys, been, though? Because you've um, been slowly taking them out this time. Yeah. Which is ideal. Well, like, uh, no, it has to be the sectoid because because it's just gonna revive something, or you know, ideally, the I want. The first game spent a very long time rendering the sectoids posterior. Let's say. Really. That's yeah, they're, they're good old alien but <laughs> 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 Gotta get some alien but <laughs> um, Can you move there, my love? And now, can you fire a frag grenade? Would that would that hit anything? I, uh, I, uh, Wait, hoping. where are we? They're they're behind there, aren't they? They're behind that wall, yes. And you're hoping that the wall takes some damage. Smashy, or... smashy. Smashy smashy! What do you reckon, you guys? That that position you're at right now, I think, is your best bet. Fire in the hole! Once he gets the correct gun out. Oh! Okay! That, that was alright! Luna's shouting, down with walls! Down with walls! <laughs> Blasting the walls, great! Down with this kind of thing! <laughs> <laughs> careful now, though. Yeah, careful now. Careful, careful, careful now. Um, let's put you on Overwatch. You can't really move very far, can you? Um, right, Johnny. I think you should be to eleven viewers. Why does everybody come to watch the pain? <laughs> <laughs> God, overwatch that bitch! Ah, oh, come on! Get the sec toy. Get the sec toy. toy. Get that sec toy. <laughs> oh, he's zombieing his mates. Oh man, no! That wall is in danger, though. Flipping egg is collapsing even more. We enjoy your suffering, says Lunar. <sighs> oh, he's he's holding on by a thread. Oh, he's oh, this guy is. I do have one more frag grenade. It's up to you. It gives us nourishment, our suffering. Yes. Good stuff. <sighs> Go down, zombie. No. Now that zombie's just gonna. Yeah! Ah! Oh. 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 Yeah. Ignore the zombies, kill the sect when the zombies die. Yeah, we, we assumed that, Luna, but uh, it's good to see in practice. <laughs> Here comes Save Scum 4! <laughs> Should I do Save Scum 4? I feel like Save Scum 3 is no, kind no, of Save okay. Scum save Scum 3 is fine. <laughs> Actually, no, I won't. I won't mention that because it sounds like something that should be fun to watch, and I don't want people leaving our stream. Oh! Oh! Famous last words. Kaboom! Oh God, it's not over. <laughs> So you need oh to God. escape with the vial and escape with all your dudes and funeral for Snipey. Okay, so where's my extraction point? It's fucking right over there, of course it is. It's not too far, at least it's sort of in the direction you were going. Hey, if you could control save space and time, wouldn't you? Nothing wrong with saving. Yeah, oh God, that's true. Into... Are we getting into Undertale territory here? I've got one more frag grenade, bitches. Come at All me. Right, so they're bringing reinforcements, but... But you have cover. I have cover. I have one more frag grenade. I have a dude on Overwatch who 
shot through a shot wall, wall apparently okay yeah take it's it. fine we'll take it we'll take it we took one out that's fine so now we've got two more god damn right um watch the reinforcements yeah we're, we're keeping an eye okay you right, so i think this is if, if we pull this off i think this is a pretty good learning experience we lost the sniper but You've learned to play very cautiously, which is very important in this game. <laughs> <laughs> I guess he doesn't have the grenade. Um, he d he does have he does have the grenade. Um, let's see what damage that could do. If any, yeah. No, you wait that's not worth. I want to wait till the yeah. yeah. I want to wait till yeah, down. So, down. so let's Overwatch you, Ms. Kelly here. Can she go next to you, maybe, and then try and shoot from there? You're just gonna get shit. Um, I don't want her to move too close. You see. Yeah. Fuck it. Let's put her on Overwatch as well, because I think it's gonna come if it comes round. Right. So we're wanting to grenade them as soon as they get close enough. Yeah. So the damage, many bullets! <laughs> the damage isn't what matters, it's getting rid of the cover. And that's true, the cover, once we get rid of the cover, like the. Yo, duck guy! I was worried that was gonna hit your guy. Oh, yeah. Um, can we can we go now? No. Um, it's this dude who has it. You need to try and get a part of the wall as well, if possible. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, nope, nope, nope. Wibble, wibble, wobble. That's the point. Fire in the hole! Come on! Do it for Bob! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, three damage, overwatch removed. He did. Is the other guy dead? Uh, I don't know if it caught the other guy, but you did remove some cover. <laughs> oh! Oh, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, charge, know. Johnny! Charge! All right. Okay. Was that the last dude? Enemy down. Um. Yeah. Do we proceed with caution, or do we just run like hell? You may want to heal Johnny on the way out so that he's fit for another mission. Yeah, that's true, actually. Um. She can't move too far though. Like, yeah, she can't awesome. move and then heal Johnny. Oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. So they're pulling in more reinforcements? Yeah. You can sprint into the evac. Says Lunar. Oh, just our range! <laughs> <laughs> of course. What is life? Um, okay. Alright. Okay, Johnny. Let's at least get you into some cover. Uh, Luna also mentions they changed the wound system. Healing doesn't reduce the wound time. I want her to heal him because in case shit hits the fan again. I'm with you. It doesn't cost that much supply to make med kits. Now you're healed and smell minty fresh. <laughs> Get guys close. Evac next turn. Yeah. Potentially. Yeah, yeah. Let's just run. I just need to get one guy, don't I? I just need to get one guy there, don't I? Uh, I think so. Oh, Johnny, he can't move anymore. No, I need to finish off his turn. Fuck. Oh, 
Oh, here they come. Right, luckily, enemy can't shoot the turn we come in. <laughs> so they can only land this turn. Uh, but unfortunately, you do need to get everyone there. Oh, god damn. But if I get one guy there... No, they've all got to climb up the fucking mountain, haven't they? Oh yeah, that's what I think that's what Luna was saying, trying to say last turn is just forget cover, just run, yeah. Alright, well, we're here now. And Taz McCann is talking about Gene Bath. <laughs> I, I guess that's the goo that was Should in have there. charged to the ev evac so everyone could leave here. Yeah, no, it's too bad, isn't it? Well, we can do it now. Yeah, you climb up that rock face. Come on. We've got here. Shit. That's what I was worried about. Ooh. Okay. And let's check. You can also get a mod called Evac All, which is effectively, I guess, a minor form of cheating, but. <laughs> Ignore. <gasps> no! Well, here comes our friend, Mr. Turret. It's only come online, though. So you, you should have time to evac this turn. Oh, I need to click evac. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, why is nothing happening? Well, hopefully this guy, now that he's been on a successful mission... Ta -da! And you got an achievement in the bottom <sighs> that for? A horrible truth. <laughs> Is that presumably for dis no, presumably for discovering the Dunkety and the Sludge. Oh, okay. I killed 16 out of 21 enemies, so that wasn't even the final wave. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, that was awful. I don't know, that's a good learning experience. Like, it wasn't oh, you best. don't have to wait for everyone. Okay, that's a good, that's a good spot. My god. My god. <laughs> Oh yeah, Goto. Poor old Goto. Oh, Goto. Snipey Goto. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. You're only a squaddy though, so... Well, we've been going for about two hours, so I think that's probably a good stopping point. I think this is a good stopping point. Oh, it's meant to cut down the, the misclicking. Oh, okay, honestly I don't see what you mean by... They're having a discussion about RNG. Oh, you should I see. Save. Yeah, I should save. I should save. Good God, I should save. <laughs> Whew. And then go lie down. My God, this yeah, is I'm this is gonna, a. I'm probably gonna have to go check on mom right now. So. This was a longer stream than I thought it was gonna be. <laughs> I was like, yeah, no, let's pop totally up. Fine. Like... I'm, I'm, I enjoyed it. Oh, sorry. I like is a it? Bit, I like a bit of drama. We we had we had some failure, but we came back from it. You came back from it. Oh, just about. Well, let's promote everybody and. Um, Blast padding or shredder. Your cannon attacks shred armor. What are you going for? Blast padding? Yeah. Because you put shredder in the other one, didn't you? Yeah. Yeah. Medic, medic. Luna is shouting, shredder! <laughs> shredder, no, I went to. Um, Shadow. I have another person somewhere who yeah, has yeah, Shredder. Yeah, got another one with Shredder. Uh, about... Well concealed, 25 bonus aim, second enemy, or does not trigger Overwatch or reaction fire. Um, I think I have somebody else who has Shadow Strike, so let's give him Shadow Step. 
imagine Luna is a bit of a, a glass cannon player. Glass padding is awful though, oh shit. <laughs> imagine they're a bit of a glass cannon sort of player where they play risky but but try and dodge everything instead. Oh, we're getting a commander. That car is more troubling than I'd expected. Oh, you're actually quite a tank player. Tank player, okay. You absorb damage a lot and med kicks and the like. Yeah, that's probably closer to our play. Um. Alrighty, so shall we? Yeah, we let's and save and we'll call it. See, thank you to everybody who joined us. Thank you, busier. Yeah, it was it was good. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the tips, Lunar. And yeah, everybody. much 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 appreciated. And everybody else who joined in, uh, I hope you enjoy your PlayStation VR, Lilith. Uh, and thanks for joining us. Uh, some of our other regulars, Lassiku and Pixel Spire. Um, it's uh, nice to see some new people. Uh, if you enjoyed this stream, oh. please, please, please give us a follow. I'm uh, just seeing that um, what Luna is saying. Oh. Oops. It's a lot of text. Oh, All right. Okay. There, there we go. We, go. <laughs> we get the thank you screen. Oh. All right. So I'll let you do the outro. Um, yeah, so thanks for joining us, you guys, and again, thanks for the tips, Luna. I've learned many lessons tonight. <laughs> um, if you enjoy the stream, do follow to be notified when we go live. We really appreciate all of our followers. Um, and you can check out more by us. We do a podcast, we do some writing, that's at ready-up.net. You can follow us on Facebook or Twitter at ReadyUp. And we upload our stream archives to Ready Up Video on YouTube shortly after. So thanks for joining you guys um, on this. God, what was that? <laughs> <laughs> we'll probably be streaming this uh, soonish, let's see. So, so uh, some people at the site are having a little break soon, but we will get back to this. Yeah, yeah, we we'll continue the playthrough. Well, we have to now, don't we, really? Oh, yeah. Let's do it for is... Bob. <laughs> we'll do it for Bob. <laughs> That's the next stream title. <laughs> Okay, guys, thanks, and um, good night. Have a good evening. Bye. Take care. Bye.